Order, order. Court is now in session. Please be seated. We're looking at a case brought forward by a Mr. Edgar Martinez against a Mr. Jack Smith. Mr. Martinez, can you please tell us why we're here today? Yes, Your Honor. My name is Edgar Martinez, and I'm a contractor with a small construction crew. We were hired by Mr. Smith to construct a new kitchen unit for his home in Malibu. However, upon completion of the kitchen unit, Mr. Smith has refused to pay up, and now he owes me and my workers over $10,000. Thank you for your statement, Mr. Martinez. And uh, Mr. Smith, do you have a statement you'd like to make? Yes, Your Honor. I hired Mr. Martinez with the intention of building a kitchen unit in my new home. What I did not intend for was Mr. Martinez using illegal immigrants as part of his construction crew. When I found that out, I quickly and swiftly fired him and his crew. I see. Is this true, Mr. Martinez? Your Honor, while I did have undocumented immigrants in my crew, they are still hardworking, decent people. And in fact, I have proof that Mr. Smith specifically requested that I would hire undocumented immigrants because he believed that they would work for less money. Proof? And uh, what kind of proof? In these emails that I printed out, you will see that Mr. Smith directed me to hire undocumented immigrants. Would you please bring me those emails? Your Honor, you can't possibly believe those emails. It's so easy to forge something like that. Please, do not talk out of turn, Mr. Smith. This is my courtroom. I'm gonna review this evidence in my chambers. The court will take a one hour recess. Yes. Mr. Smith. Apologies for the surprise, Your Honor. I needed to seek private audience with you, though. Why is that? Well, we both know that I'm a very powerful man in this city, and I happen to be a large contributor and very close friend to the great governor of this state. The governor would not be all too thrilled if he found out that illegal aliens were working on my home. And why are you telling me any of this? Well, the governor is in charge of promoting judges to the state Supreme Court. And he's not exactly the sort of guy you want as an enemy. If you catch my drift. I see. Okay. Well, I appreciate you sharing this with me, Mr. Smith. No, no. The pleasure is all mine, Your Honor. I'm just looking out for your best interest. As a friend would. Counting on you to make the right decision. Court is back in session. Please be seated. Upon looking at the evidence presented by Mr. Martinez, I've been able to make a clear decision. It is evident that Mr. Smith, in fact, did request that Mr. Martinez use illegal immigrants to bring the cost of his construction down. Thus, it is evident that Mr. Smith, you will be paying Mr. Martinez in full for his services. Plus, you will be paying an additional $5,000 in damages. Thank you, Your Honor. Your Honor, you cannot be serious. Oh, I'm very serious, Mr. Smith. And I expect Mr. Martinez to be paid by the end of this week. Judge Walters, think about your career. Okay, this could be very damaging to you. Mr. Smith, I will not be intimidated in my courtroom. I told you to keep your mouth shut. I now find you $1,000 for being in contempt with the court. You are making a big mistake, Judge. Court is adjourned. <laughs>